Hi, welcome to I Love the Library. My name is Deb and I'm the Public Services Supervisor here. I want to tell you about a program we're having November 19th at 7 p.m. First question, however, where were you November 22nd, 1963? That's right, it's the 50th anniversary this year of the John F. Kennedy assassination. I remember where I was. I was sitting in fourth grade classroom and when we heard the news and they, because I was at a Catholic school, they took us over to church to pray. On November 19th here at the library, Professor Steve Hoffbeck from M Moorhead State University will be doing a presentation on the Kennedy assassination. Things I'd like people to consider are, how did that change you? And we have a number of questions for you to think of. Um, how old were you? Where were you living at the time? How did you hear about the shooting? And what was your initial reaction? And did it change your life in some way? Hopefully Steve will be addressing some of these issues. In the meantime, we have a number of books that are about John F. Kennedy, and I've got to tell you about one that I just finished reading. This one is JFK's Last 100 Days by Thurston Clark. I really found it interesting. It deals with the time uh, in August 1963 till assassination day. And it seems at that time there were some, I don't know if I want to say significant changes, but some real growth specifically during that time period. Um, it starts with the death of his infant son or newly born son Patrick and of course runs to that fateful day in Dallas. Along the way, Clark describes um, some of Kennedy's, uh, for lack of a better term, uh, feelings like about dealing with Khrushchev, dealing with the race issue, or civil rights. So it was really interesting seeing his growth in that. A lot of other books that we're featuring, we have a display here for you to take a look at, plus other books on the shelf. Jack Kennedy, Elusive Hero. JFK and the Unspeakable, An Unfinished Life by Robert Dalek, and The Bystander. This one is John F. Kennedy and the Struggle for Black Equality. So look at this, J Jack, a life like no other. Um, John F. Kennedy, and this is a presidential portfolio. One I think is really moving after the assassination, of course a lot of Americans were touched and they wrote letters to Jackie and the children, so here's a book. Uh, Condolences from a Grieving Nation, Letters to Jackie. And The Kennedy Curse. How come this one family seems to have so much happening to them? Hard to say. So hopefully you'll be here November 19th to hear uh, the presentation by history professor Steve Hoffbeck and it'll bring back, I don't know if I want to say memories, but it'll remind you of an earlier time in our nation's history. See you at the library.